Today we're going to talk a little bit about dressing sticks. Now a dressing stick is simply a compressed block of an aluminum oxide abrasive. This is a stick that we carry. It's about 2 inch by 2 inch by 6 inch in an 80 grit aluminum oxide. We use this stick for dressing or resharpening centered diamond tools like say your saw blade or a core drill. Now a centered diamond tool is different from an electroplated diamond in the fact that the centering process the entire diamond part of a centered tool is a mixture of metal and diamond. So with your saw blades or your core drills, the entire rim of this saw blade is all diamond. So as your diamonds wear down and the blade is not cutting as well, you can take something like our dressing stick here, make a slice through it, and it will actually strip off a layer of this softer metal that has diamond in it and expose a brand new layer of diamonds underneath essentially making a brand new saw blade or a brand new core drill out of your piece of equipment. Great way to extend the life of your tool and a great way to make sure that you're getting the most out of your tool. So let's take a look at how we would use this with a saw blade and the difference a dressing stick can make. So we have here our Husqvarna Tilematic wet saw and on here we have Husqvarna Superlock Glass Plus Blade. Now the Superlock Glass Plus Blade is a fine grit diamond blade meant for cutting thinner glass materials. It's going to have a much harder time going through thicker glass and you're going to wear it out a lot faster if you do try and go through thicker glass. The other side is even going through thinner glass, the fine grit super lock blade will have to be dressed more often than a medium grit blade, something like the MK303 or one of the result blades, which are going to take far longer before they're going to need to be dressed. So to give you an idea, this blade has been on this saw for quite a while. We've cut a lot of different things with it it's getting close to the point where it really should be dressed. It can probably still go a little bit longer, but it's at a good point where I can show you the difference in the cuts. So I've got a thin piece of glass here. This is probably about a quarter inch thick, and I'm gonna make a cut through here, probably not all the way through, but at least it'll give you an idea of how quickly this blade is running when it's not dressed or when it needs to be dressed. So we're gonna take a quick slice out of this piece of glass just to show you how fast it goes. You can see that's, that's not bad. It went back through pretty quickly actually. So uh, this blade is not all that bad. You get a really nice clean cut. You can see here from this piece of glass, there's very little chipping on the edge of the glass. Uh, it does a really nice job. I really like the Superlock Glass Plus blade. It just gives an excellent cut on the glass. Um, but I'm gonna dress this real quick and at least show you how that works. So I've got a used dressing stick here that we've been using in our shop for a while now. Now to dress a diamond blade or a core drill or anything else along that lines, all you really have to do is make sure your dressing stick covers the entire area of the diamond. So with a saw blade, I'm gonna make a very, very thin cut out of my dressing stick, just making sure that I have a dressing stick on both sides of the saw blade, so I'm dressing both sides of the blade. So I'll set this up for a very thin cut and just do a quick cut on this. That's really all it takes. Okay, now that I have dressed this blade, it will have exposed brand new diamonds on the edge of this saw. So it'll be almost like a brand new blade again on the saw. So let's make another cut on our piece of glass and see if it goes any faster than our first cut. Well, that went significantly faster than our first cut. And you can see our second cut, it's still a great edge on the glass, virtually chip free from that Superlock Glass Plus blade, but it went through the glass significantly faster. So it was almost like making a brand new blade out of this to dress the blade. So if you get to a point with your saw blades, if you see a lot of excess chipping, or if your glass is sparking, or if 
you see a lot of blowout or you feel a lot of pressure to get the glass to go through the blade, you know, grab your dressing stick, take that one little slice out of it, dress the blade, it'll be like a brand new saw blade again. Mm -hmm.